What's up, fam? Mr. Cut, the CEO, back in the house again. Man, look, I know y'all been looking for me, wondering where I've been, what's going on. We ain't got a video here today, but uh, on this uh, Wednesday. But I got this one for you for Thursday morning. Man, look, out here uh, Wednesday night, they getting ready to get started. I got three on this one here tonight on this particular job. I got three here? Yeah, three. No, I got four on this particular job and uh, two on the other job. And then three on another job. So we got all nine out tonight. And man, look, I'll tell you what. You know, at one time, I just would be happy to get four or five out a night. And I had told myself, I said, look, we ain't going to be trying to do all that, man, running on nine trucks at night, too. But man, look, it is what it is. They want the trucks. And I just didn't had to build up my clientele, the driver. So that's what this video is about, man. Look, you can do it at a high level. There goes the first truck. That's my woman driver. She has loaded first and is on her way with the first load to get the night started. But look, man, I realized in order to do it at a high level like this, you got to build up your cache of drivers and good drivers. Just don't go gathering uh, anybody. Now, here's a nugget. Here's a nugget. It's going to be a given that in the process of building a strong team, you will have to weed out some. I'm just telling you, it's a it's a fact of life. This ain't this ain't friendship. This ain't family ship. Look, man, this is business, you know. And you can uh, do a meme or make a joke out of me saying business, right? Because I'm saying it just like that. And a lot of times, man, what happens? People will get mad with you for making decisions that's in the best interest of your company and your business. But man, look, if you got some people that you need to weed out, some bad apples, some guys that don't want to listen, don't want to do it the way that you say you want it done, then, hey, man, don't be afraid to pull that trigger. Get your ducks in a row and pull the trigger because what's going to happen is if you wait too long, they're going to hurt you. And I'm here to tell you I've been in it long enough to know jokers will hurt you, hurt your business, tell you I'm sorry out the way uh, on their way out the door, and then you're stuck dealing with the aftermath of whatever it is that you know you should have got rid of them for in the first place, right? So that's the nugget for the day, dealing with drivers. Uh, if you're going to do it at a high level at night, running a lot of trucks at night, you got to build up your cache of drivers, right? Build up your cache and team of drivers for day and night drivers. That's number one. Number two, just know in doing that, it's just a given that some of the one, some of them go sneak in that may not necessarily be uh, guys that you want to keep around, right? <laughs> so you're going to have to weed out. There go, there go one of my... There go my Oh, quad axle uh, international coming on in. Need a fourth one. You're going to have to weed out some jokers. And it ain't about family ship or kin friendship. It's about business, man. And yeah, you ain't going to be liked. Yeah, some of them going to talk about you. Yeah, some of them going to have an issue with you. Just with integrity, handle it the right way. And you can sleep at night well knowing that you did what's best for your business. Ain't nothing wrong with telling a joker, look. I don't, uh, you know what, brother, uh, uh, sister, you're not a good fit for what the culture and the team we're trying to build for over here. Best wishes to you. Appreciate what you've done. And uh, we're going to part ways at this point. And that's the bottom line. All right. So those are some nuggets over the years. And even now that I still use as a template to uh, handle my situation when it comes to drivers, because it's a given when you're building up this kind of uh, number of drivers for me, I'm running. I'm dealing with anywhere between 15 to 20 guys week in and week out that drive for me. You're going to have some slip in that may not necessarily be a good fit for your team. Country CEO, man, look, I miss y'all. I'm going to seek it out, hit y'all on the last couple of days of this month. I'm out of here. I'm gone.